Hey guys, what's going on? Legit Arsgiven here with my second upload on tonight, and it's kind of weird because tonight's a school night, and so my parents are wondering why I've been spending so much time in the basement, and of course, they kind of semi-know I make videos on YouTube, but I've not told them it's about RuneScape, and I haven't really told them uh, my YouTube channel because I don't want them creeping on my videos, but anyway, I've been down in my basement all night tonight, and I've been actually trying to figure out what I want to show you guys, so I'm actually doing a one, uh, a one, I guess, farm patch farm run and it's gonna be really quick then I'm gonna get actually show you guys a QBD kill and it's actually gonna be really hard to uh, I guess talk over this clip because I get really stressed out and really nervous when I go to QBD but I'm gonna try and show you guys as best as possible how I actually do QBD and so let me just open up my computer I'm gonna actually okay I that was weird but anyway I'm gonna show you guys how I do QBD hopefully I actually get a good drop I have not had a drop there in about five or six kills and I know that sounds really weird like oh you expect drops every time you go to QBD and I, I actually kind of do I I've been really lucky at QBD and I expect not to go dry tonight I'm gonna show you guys one kill and it should take three to four minutes um, but it probably will take five to six considering I'll be trying to talk during it so I'm gonna try to make it as interesting as possible and um, I'm really nervous I don't know why I still get nervous when I go to QBD, even though I was less nervous when I was betting 1.2 bill. So it's kind of weird. Um, I still get jittery. I don't really even know why, because I expect to die every single time. It's kind of just like, if I don't die, I'm really proud of myself, and if I, if I do die, I stop QBD for like the whole day, because once I die once, I just get so demotivated to keep on going. So my setup, I do use the Maul, because it's the strongest crush weapon in the game, full Elite Void, and I will be using a uh, Warrior Ring and uh, my actual attack cape this time instead of my fire cape so I should almost have besides the fire cape or the tokar cow I should have max melee crit percentage and max uh, I guess damage so I should be pretty good I'm actually gonna also uh, safe up and use my vampirism aura as well which uh, I don't really know how much it heals you let's actually see that real quick 5% of what you damage so it really doesn't do much to be honest um, but I guess when I hit 5,000, it, it heals me 5% of that. Um, so not too bad, I guess. And I think we have everything good that we need. So 6.5k health. And I also do my Terror Bird. And I also bring Extremes. I need Extremes, not all the time. But I usually do 2 kills per Extreme pot up. Um, that sounds weird how I phrase that. But every dose of Extreme gets me 2 kills. That might be bad. That might be good. I'm pretty sure that's okay. And I'm not going to bring a tab. I never really do. And then I only need one prayer pot per kill. I know that's kind of weird. I guess it's really risking it if I do go below. That, that would kind of suck. Um, but not like you can really get smited out for anything. It's just the mage prey that you really need. And I know I'm taking way too long right now. I'm panicking because I'm on video. But here we go. I'm actually using sharks. I don't like wasting money on... I, know, I don't know why my cursor is like loading something. I actually am rendering a video um, in the background and producing videos in it. Ugh, it's just crazy. But, um, so sorry if you guys get annoyed by my mouse doing the loading symbol. It's going to probably be doing that the whole video. So let's do this anyway. I am ready. I'm going to kill QBD. And I actually do need to add a new ultimate. I never use Berserk. And I don't really know why. But um, I guess I never really take the time to use Berserk. Because it actually doubles your damage for 20 seconds. But I never really use it. Unless it's like the first or second stage. Which it's kind of a waste to use Berserk on your first or second stage. Because it's not really the hardest stage. So I'm actually going to use a new ultimate ability that I can actually, actually use. Wow, I said actually weird there. And uh, I'm not really sure. I want to use one that uh, attacks targets around you as well. So therefore I can attack tortured souls as well. Um, actually pulverize sounds pretty good. Uh, frenzied attack less than 10 seconds. Targets standing directly in front of you take damage. Equal to 20% of the... Ooh. Oh, you have to be... Okay, I'm going to use this one. Pulverize. That I don't think I've seen any video makers really usually using it. I'm sure someone out there uses it, but I guess I've never really seen it in bossing. Um, so my very first QBD kill on camera, full length, I think... Actually, no, I showed you guys me dying and me successfully doing one, but you guys were like... Oh man, you really do suck at QBD. I think I, I like to think I've gotten better, guys. So let me know in the comments below. You suck or you rock. I don't know. However you want to phrase it, but I, I still get nervous. Like I don't know why, but I get like butterflies in my stomach, like I'm giving a speech at school or something. Um, but here we go. Everything's ready. And sorry, guys, if I do not talk. Um, I could be playing music, but I really don't feel like it because I don't want to get involved with all the copyright issues. So here we go. No, I'm not nervous. Not like my hands are shaking or anything, because my hands definitely don't shake when I get nervous. That was a joke. Let's do this. I am ready. Alright, I think I got everything ready. And... Pairs on. Get ready to die, beast. 
All right, guys. So the first oh, I should usually hit there. The first stage should be pretty easy for me. Uh, of course, there's my luck. Usually, it doesn't uh, spawn too many fire waves on the first uh, two stages. So. Uh, I guess there's my luck, but this should go pretty quickly, the first and second stages, and hopefully get as few, I guess, what are they called, um, those larvae, those grot worms, they're like mini grot worms, basically, I want to get as few of those as possible, because the majors actually hit me pretty hard, and I don't want those already, and I've actually lost a lot of health, I usually don't use lose this much health in the first stage, to be honest, but I guess that's expected, and I probably should eat up. Um, the reason why I bring so much food is just in case, so that way I can save up and come on, don't spawn a mage, but it does every time, and no grot worm, okay, that's good. And then after the first stage, I get off to the side because it can use its fire fire breath, okay, to the west, to the west. See, I, I west stepped it, and it still kind of didn't do anything. So we're going to, you know, kill the tortured soul, just like that, and try to hit QBD at the same time. But like I was saying, those little spawned larvas things, they hit mage, so eventually by the third or fourth stage, I start praying mage instead, because they do add up quite quickly. And let's use this. Alright, that was pretty good, that was pretty good. That was efficient. Not too many uh, larva things. And let's go get it. Maybe I'm like better or more lucky on camera, that'd be... Okay, west, west, west. Alright, okay, that was not bad. As long as I stun one of them, I'm okay with that. And then I can kill one of them. And, again, sorry if my commentary is a little off. You guys can expect me to be a little more nervous because, again, I'm not that good at bossing, as you guys know, even though I should be. Um, and we're going to swing the big one. I have not used Pulverize yet, guys. I will save that ultimate ability for the last stage when it's all clear. Of course, the last stage is the hardest one and probably the hardest one to use an ultimate on because an ultimate usually lasts a long amount of time. So we're going to start safing up. Okay, west, 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 come on. Oh, yes, perfect. Now, I should be doing that every single time. Uh, oh, dang it, dang it. No, go, go, go. Touch the pillar. I hate this. He starts spawning a lot of grot worms. And I hate the timing that I have that I go right through the fire stage. And I need to safe up. And here we go. Here's when he usually spawns a lot of tortured souls on me. So, uh, oh, wow. That's lucky. So I'm going to try to tank the tortured souls. Oh, no, 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 no not, this, not this time. Oh, see, that fire breath always surprises me. And here we go, free stage. So if that fire breath would have been on the free stage, I would have been screwed over. But I'm going to actually get to the left of this thing. That way I can easier left step uh, when I get... Alright, so I kind of just wasted, I guess. And see, there he is healing off the tortured soul. So I want to kill it. And let's go. I have not u yet used my ultimate. I might not get to. I need to save up here. Just a little bit of lag to make me scary, or make it a little more scary. And I almost have my ultimate, dang it. Ultimate. Oh, almost died. Man, what the heck? Die, please. Oh, we almost have it, guys. Don't die now. And we did it. Nice job. Not too bad, I guess. Um, again, please comment below, guys, how I did on efficiency. I might still die here with the, from the fire waves and all that crap. Um, but comment below, hey, that was not bad. Hey, that was okay. I think I used just about a full inventory of shark, which is still, it's worth it because I hopefully will get good loot. And again, I want to apologize a third time if the commentary is not too good. You can't blame me. I'm not used to doing QBD on camera. I'm actually not going to do QBD again. It's really kind of boring after a while, but let's see if we got any good loot. Ah, dang it. I was hoping we'd get good loot on camera, but anyway, hope you guys enjoyed this second upload of the night, and until next time, have a great day, have a great night, and good luck scaping.